The last two weeks have been full of adventure exploring Vancouver Island, which has left us speechless at every chance with the most incredible and diverse landscapes we have seen. From hidden waterfalls, rugged coastline, towering forests and mountain ranges, this place should be on everyone's travel bucket list. If you haven't seen that series, make sure you check it out after this video. For now, we're back on mainland Canada and are off to one of Vancouver's top tourist hotspots, the Capilano Suspension Bridge. Please hit subscribe and enjoy today's video. Today is a very exciting day. Two reasons. One, it's a day before our cruise. We finally leave on our cruise tomorrow. Hi. <laughs> I don't know if you heard that on the camera, that was nasty. <laughs> and then the second thing is we are doing something that we've been trying to do since we've come to Canada, but I don't know, we just kind of never wanted to fork out the money at the times we've been in Vancouver. And that is we're going to go to the Capilano Suspension Bridge. It's like one of the main attractions that you can do in Vancouver. It's a beautiful day. We've honestly had the best weather, touch wood, since we've been traveling in this off season. Nice day. <laughs> So we're off to do that today, which I'm very, very excited about. And we're going to get some donuts as well. Mmm, donuts. That is shaky. So y'all don't even have to intentionally shake it. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> this is massive. Look at the size of this thing. Oh my god, look at it swaying. <laughs> I don't know how I feel about this. Oh my gosh, the swaying is next level. It's so far down. Oh my lord. I don't know how I feel about the suspension bridge. My legs still feel tingly after walking across it. I think it's good. It's pretty funny watching everyone get the panic grab and yeah. people start walking. <laughs> like in general, I'm pretty good with heights, but ever since our paragliding accident in Bali, I just have trust issues with anything that's attached to like rope or any kind of like suspended thing. Didn't love it. Just ropes in general. Chelsea's a bit slight phobia now. Yeah, like understandable. Flying foxy sort of things and. I don't know, just anything like that. I just, I don't lie, my feet get very tingly. I imagine this is what it feels like to be like scared of heights, which I'm not used to. <laughs> For people that don't know about the incident, maybe we could try and find the video. This is us coming in from our time in the air. I had the GoPro on my wrist with no idea what was about to unfold. This is what snapped. As we got closer to the boat, this guy told us to run. And the next thing we knew, we were being swept off the back of the boat and into the water. Still attached to the open parachute, it dragged us for about 100 meters, dunking us in and out of the water. It did eventually come to a stop with the weight of the parachute starting to get heavier as it went under the water. Thankfully though, within seconds, we were being helped out of the harness. Still in shock, we were all smiles leaving with no injuries. But this is why I've got the phobia of the ropes. So now we've crossed the bridge, we're gonna start walking around through the rest of the park. It's massive here, like way bigger than I thought it was. I knew there was more than just the bridge, but like Brandon just thought it was just the bridge. <laughs> Dumbass. So <laughs> we're gonna go and explore. They've got like a little treetop walk or a I cliff think walk. We're going and... to Predator Ridge. Predator Ridge, here we go. I love that when they're doing the pass, they're not trying to disturb the trees or anything as well like everywhere you walk if there's a tree there they just smack a hole in the tree and away they go <laughs> I don't like the ropes, Brandon doesn't like the height. We're a pair, aren't we? We are high up. Holy moly. Free top walk wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be, but now we're heading back across the bridge, which I don't love. Wish me luck. I feel like coming across the second time is not so bad. Like, actually, I'm having some time to enjoy it a little bit more. Yeah, and when you read the thing, ah, these cables are yeah, still cables, just one side. Are you serious? They fully loaded 18 miles, I mean, so 
You got two of them. <laughs> That's pretty good. I'm not quite as heavy as 18, 18. Well, eight. well was it eight? eight 18 wheelers. <laughs> so it's that actually really we pretty. can go and like, treat ourselves to a donut or something. You! <laughs> It is actually really pretty. Once you get over like the craziness of the swaying of the bridge, it's actually a beautiful view. The amount of people that just stop at the start of the bridge is neck level. We have so much room for activities right now. All right, our last stop for today is the cliff walk. We are all done exploring the park now. We're just gonna stop for some lunch. We're just gonna go house in a burger, but we're so glad that we came here. It was really beautiful and just really good for like all ages. Like they've got the beautiful boardwalks and then there's all like little things for kids along the way, like bits of information that you can have a look out for. And they've got little nature talks along the way about different animals. Just a really cool like interactive thing. Like if you're thinking that it's just the bridge, it's not just the bridge. There's lots of other things that you can do here. To continue with our healthy food from our burger at lunch, we've come and gotten some donuts. But these aren't just any donuts, they're called honey donuts. They're at Deep Cove, and they're actually one of the very first things that we had in Canada, weren't they? Had out, yeah. Yeah, sure. so we came here. Our friend Jason did like a little tour with us, like around North Vancouver, and took us to a couple of places. and Honey donuts was one of them, so it's kind of cool coming back and having them again. It's a place where famous people come, like mm. Reese. I don't know, there's like all sorts of sightings from different John celebrities. Cena and a few yeah. other celebrities come around here for donuts, so yeah. we're basically famous. Basically famous, guys. We're eating at the same place as famous people. <laughs> you can dream, you can dream. So, we're gonna eat these and we're gonna enjoy this beautiful view, and we're gonna see you guys in the next video when we're gonna be on a cruise. And we'll see you next time. See you next week, guys, on a boat. Bye.